The growing Beyonce backlash, the singer getting grief for her controversial video for the song Formation and for her performance at the Super Bowl halftime show earlier this month. Now, some police unions are very unhappy with what they see as her anti-cop message and calling for a law enforcement boycott during her tour. ABC's Eva Pilgrim joins us in studio with more on this developing story. Hi, Eva. Good morning, guys. The fallout from Beyonce's Super Bowl performance is gaining ground now. Cops all across the country are refusing to go to her show. This morning, Queen Bee facing a police boycott of her upcoming tour, creating security questions. Most venues depend on officers to volunteer for at least some of the security shifts. And now some union leaders are calling for cops not to be on hand when her formation comes to their cities. I got hot sauce in my bag. Swag. The Fraternal Order of Police in Miami, where Beyonce's tour kicks off, citing controversy over the star's Super Bowl halftime show. Okay, ladies, now let's be and taking a vote to suggest all law enforcement officers boycott the April 26th concert, claiming that the superstar promotes an anti-police message in her latest music video. Despite the independent union leaders' calls, the Miami Police Department reassuring fans that it will have a sufficient number of police officers staffing this and every event that happens in our city. I might get your phone played on the radio station. <laughs> but the idea of a Beyonce strike may be catching on. The president of the Nashville Police Union calling for a similar protest by cops it represents. Ultimately, we're asking the officers not to, not to volunteer. In addition to Miami and Nashville police unions in Tampa also calling for some form of boycott when Beyonce rolls into town, with Houston, Boston, and New York considering swearing off showing up when she comes to slay. But not every police union is ready to get information. In a statement to ABC News, the president of the Dallas Police Association writing, our only focus at this time is reducing the recent surge in violent crime in Dallas. Now we've reached out to Beyonce for comment on the boycott. They are not issuing a comment this morning. Interesting that we're seeing movement against her in Houston, her hometown. Mm -hmm. Interesting story. Thank you. Appreciate it.